first, I would like to thank you all for celebrating with us this evening. Um, this is the love and support that nurtures the lives of so many within our community. So it is only right for us to honor all of those behind the scenes, some who have been mentioned today and others who have been men, who work so hard to keep this community thriving. Um, that's just really important to me because so many things that we got to have, you know, that students don't know, you know what I mean? What really is the work behind it? So I'm really big on that and really big on sharing, you know, my appreciation as you'll see from my family. Um, secondly, I have to say, I will go on and on, which I just had to stop myself right now, um, about our Seattle Central community. Um, that's the only reason I wrote this, to stay focused on time. <laughs> that's the truth. Um, my name is Myron Curry. I'm a re-entry student, and in my case, uh, meaning previously incarcerated. Um, I'm also a recent graduate of Seattle Central. During my incarceration, <laughs> and again, it would never have happened, and I'm just saying this expressively right now, if it wasn't for every single person and every single staff member in Seattle Central, like literally emailing, calling, during COVID, all those things, you know, like pressing me, like just try, you know, don't give up today, you know, just make it through today, and I made it, you know, and my love goes out. Um, so during my incarceration, I was always highly focused on education and self-improvement. I planned on continuing my education, but never thought it would be such an amazing experience. I'm from Seattle, so deciding on Seattle Central was a natural decision pre-release. I'll never forget the day I walked into Student Support Program's door at Seattle Central. I was extremely skeptical because of how nice the team was. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, Vanessa, Marvin, Maria, Miranda, Carrie, Ariel, so many people, and even my mom is here today to even remember me calling her saying, Thank you, Moscow. And that's where the love comes from, you know? Um, but I was calling her like, oh, they're so nice. I, I feel, it just felt uncomfortable. Like, <laughs> and she's like, it's okay, we try nice. You know, you can see So um, I came back every day and sat at the same desk that I took my re-entry test, or my entry test in, in that office, every single day. Um, and the passion for supporting my students put my skepticism at ease, and I loved that. I began to help students coming through that same door and shortly earned a job position of peer-to-peer -peer navigator specializing in re-entry. Um, it was natural for me because I was just extending all the resources I used myself. As I mentioned, I'm a re-entry student, so I understand the justice system thoroughly. I won't go into politics or policies that aid a person with systemic racism, but I will say it would have been near impossible to attend, let alone graduate, Seattle Central without the strength and consistency of its community and student support programs. They made it possible for me and many others in my situation. There are constant battles to receive basic rights. They are not given without a fight. The student support programs team fight that fight relentlessly to fend off oppression, exploitation, and humanity we face daily. It wouldn't have been able, I wouldn't have been able to financially afford college either. I was homeless, I had no income, no means of transportation, um, and they just assisted as a team. Some stuff that wasn't even on like a program, like housing, you know. Sometimes we don't have a necessary program for something. But when you love what you're doing and you're loving supporting people, you figure out a way, you find a way, right? And that's what I mean. So um, I found all those things, you know, a job, transportation, um, a place to stay, you know, um, which my studio is beautiful, you know, like, like you know, Yoshika mentioned. Um, you know, I got a car, I got a job, and my business is doing great. Um, so Seattle Central Student Support Programs, Financial Aid, Workforce, Slalom's Springboard A program, which is a new program that's so great. I mean, like, I'm so passionate about participating in this program. Even though I've graduated, I've still continued to participate in this program to help other students, you know? 
um, scholarships and all the other great opportunities that made this possible for me, so I want to say thank you. Um, as I began taking classes and becoming a permanent member of Seattle Central, I became good friends with all the people who helped me get through the many extreme challenges. Within the first year, I received an abundance of support and made a connection with every single department in Seattle Central Community. Um, from Kyle and Donna, financial aid, Julia and student leadership, Olaf and Trio, Taylor and workforce, Ken in the art gallery, Jerry in the Mac Center, and my amazing instructors, Ed, Greg, and Deborah, and even the president at that time, um, Sheila Edward Lane, and now currently Yoshiko, like, just to mention some, like these are just, I've tried to get all the departments, but some people don't even know where the department they work in, I just know they have And that's me, like I walk down the hall, if you have a problem or you need some help, I'm up, I'm gonna tell you, let's go. I'm gonna just walk down there with you, we're gonna figure it out, and, you know, and that's community. Um, every single one of them and all the community members encouraged and supported me like I was their blood relative. I can't express the love shared between all of them the entire Seattle Central community and myself. The support was emotionally, academically, and financially, you know, fulfilling. Um, I very quickly came to realize that it was the connection and the relation of one another and myself that made it organic to receive help and gain success. I am that same support system for other students now. I have had a tremendous amount of success being a strong community supporter. Now I've graduated and launched my design company, M. Curry Designs, which specializes in fine art, public art, interior, exterior design, and corporate branding and marketing. I now focus more time on my design company and obtain spaces for cultural arts, which extends into property development and government contract ventures. My goal now is to continue scaling my access to capital and acquiring income and producing assets to further my progress in building for the community and for generational wealth. My goal for the future is to reach and support all the other community members who want to change their lives as I have. I'm a beacon for assisting my community with resources and any knowledge I have or learning the things I do not know together. If I would be honored enough to share one piece of advice to other students who are unsure about the ability to attend community or technical college, it would be, don't be afraid to ask for help and express your appreciation to those who have supported you so that they know their actions have made an impact like you guys today. And thank you for supporting us.